this is a flyover bridge design as you can see it right here this is a 40 meter flyover bridge design which was designed here in Pota structure software as you can see it here 40 meter long flyover bridge design so right now you can see that this flyover bridge design has an embankment as you can see it here from the starting point and also an embankment at the ending point and not only that it also has a circular column having a drop down a cap as you can see it right now and also it also have a pedestrian walkway which is cantilevered as you can see it right here pedestrian walkway and also a pedestrian walkway also which is cantilevered right now and also if i turn on, on the grid right now you can also see the grid lines right here as you can see it right now but just to make it clearer for you i'm going to turn off the grid line right now and then you can see right now if i take you through this flyover bridge right now you can see what it looks like where you can see the pedestrian walkway right here and this is also a pedestrian walkway and having a steel railing right here as you can see it right now and also it, it has a deck slab as you can see it right now so if i take you through at the end of this place right now you can see that we have perfectly designed this flyover bridge design now if you want to know how to design this concrete flyover bridge design right here in Prota structure i would suggest you check on the link below and you will see the full video on how to on how to model analyze and design this flyover bridge design just here you can see the embankment of this flyover bridge right just here and you can also see the embankment on this end also now if you check on also on this design that is right now you will see that this flyover bridge has been designed successfully and also we have checked all the structural elements and they are all okay as you can see it right here the column is perfectly designed and also the embankment walls as you can see it right here they are perfectly designed okay and you can also see that these are all okay so this is so i would say that if you want to know how to design this flyover bridge right now check on the link below and download the video and then you will know how to design a flyover bridge okay so thank you and let's wait for you there hello welcome to ekidel my name is justice umaka i am your instructor today we will be learning how to insert a steel wheel on this flyover bridge design now this is the part four of this flyover bridge design now you can see right now that this flyover bridge design where we are already done with the modeling as you can see right now and we on this flyover bridge design we have also modeled for the embankment and we also have modeled the columns you can see the circular column here having a cap also and also you can see the deck slab as you can see it right here and also this flyover bridge design contains also the pedestrian walkway as you can see the cantilever on both ends as you can see cantilever here on both ends so this is the pedestrian walkway and also on the pedestrian walkway you can see the steel rail which pre which will prevent any pedestrian walkway on this pedestrian walkway of this flyover bridge from falling out as you can see that we have successfully completed all the steel rail on this on this side of this pedestrian walkway but on this side we have not completed this steel rail that is why we will be doing on this part for how to um, insert this steel rail on this flyover bridge design and also if you also look at this you will also notice that we also have an embankment bridge embankment on this other end so you can see that we use we are using protest structure for the design of this 40 meter long flyover bridge design and so if i take you through this right now you can see that this is a flyover starting from this point right now which on this place from the site plan you can see from the site plan i'll show you later that this that there, that there will be a feeling of um of soil from this down point to this level so right now this is it. we just designed the flyover bridge just here using portal structure if you want to learn how to model and design this flyover bridge from start to finish i would say that you should just check on the link below which will take you to the link where you can download the full video on the modeling and design of this flyover bridge starting from start to finish okay so right now we will begin right now to insert this steel rail on this flyover bridge but first of all let me just take you through this flyover bridge right now so that you can see how it looks like okay so right now you can see it right now this is the starting point of this flyover bridge and you can see the pedestrian walkway on the right hand side and also on the left hand side there is a can't leave a pedestrian walkway why this place right now is the bridge deck for for the vehicles to pass through and also if you check on the video link below you will see that this flavor bridge has a complete um video and also where we have um our our street light poles which we, we which are already inserted also on this end but if you want to see those features just check on the link below and download the video and then you you will see all the features right now okay so right now if i take you through right now you can see how we are going there you can see this is the this is a flyover which takes you down to the very end on this um 
check out just here so right now let's just, just go back right now to, to begin right now to insert our um, steel rails on this other end which is the part 4 of this tutorial okay so right now to insert this steel right now we will have to go and activate our grid line because i just deactivated it just to give you a clearer view to see all the features of this flyover bridge design so if i activate it right now to click on this right now and also if you go and click on this right now and go to our plan view you will also see the plan view of this flyover bridge design but right now i want to work directly on the 3d view so i'll click on this place and go back to 3d view right now okay so right now let us begin to insert this t-rail for this other end so right now what i'll do right now to insert this t -rail right now i'm using a t-rail I'm, I'm using a circular tube of size 114 by 8 by 8 thickness so what i'll do right now is to click on this steel right here steel column right now now once i click on that steel column right now i will now have to click on this place to choose my type of member so i'll click on, i'm using eu now so i'll click on eu right now and then go to tubo then on this place i'll just choose this 114 by 8 114.3 diameter by 8 thickness and i'll click on select and i'll click on what okay now on this place right now the next thing i'll do right now is to is to just insert it right now i'll just click on this place right now to insert it right now now once i click on this place right now you can see that this t-ray is going downward so i i want to make this t-ray not to come upward because this t-ray starts from this point and not going downward so what i'll do right now i'll click on this place 3d right here and then on this 3d right now i'll make this place to be 1200 and then i'll make this place to be 3000 3000 and then i'll just click on updates okay so you cannot see right now what we have just gotten right now we have in successfully inserted this steel this steel um to be here for this flyover on this side so i will also insert the same thing for this other end here so i will stick i will also click on this place right now and then i'll just begin to click to insert it just now like i said before if you want to know how to design how to model analyze and design this flyover bridge from beginning to the end check on the link below and download the video okay so i'll also click on this right now to insert this right now okay so once you're done once we are done inserting all our steel pipes right now next thing right now to do is to insert our steel guard waves so right now what i'll do right now is to click on this grid we're just here so you click on this grid right now then try to rotate this place right now to see the this these pipes clearly so right now i'll just click on one of these and then click on one of these a dialog box will appear right now next thing to do is to select the it is to select the size of these waves so i'll just click on this place right now i want to use steel on european and i'll just click on this tubo and then i want to use a a a size of diameter of 56 76.1 by 4 so i will now click on that and then click on ok and then i'll click on ok right here then i'll set on this place i'll just choose 450 as it is here then i'll just choose this place as 100 but if you check on the link below you will see more explanation on what i explained for you on how to insert this okay so i'll just click on ok and then you can see it's perfectly there so we have inserted our first um steel rays just now so the next thing i'll do right now is to click on the next column again to insert so to insert the steel guardway on this place i'll just click on this right now and then click on this again dialog box appears the same setting i'll just click on okay and then i click again on this and click again on this and then i'll click on okay and then i click again on this and then i click again on this because we have already made it automatic to insert that is why you can see if you check on the video you will see a lot of um steps which i took on how to insert this and to set all this automatic so i also click on this and click on this and then click on ok so right now you can see what we have just inserted right now on this our flyover bridge design okay so again we click on this again and then click on this also and then i click on ok and then again i click on this and i click on this and i say ok now you can see how we have successfully inserted our steel rails right now on this side and also as just as we have it on this side now if i click on escape right now it will just deselect what is here right now i can see how we have successfully inserted our c guardrails on this flyover bridge design you can see that right now so to see this clearly right now i'll just turn off my grid lines to see this clearer so you can see what we have just done right now now we have our c guardrails here and this c guardrail here also on this flyover right now you can see it right now so this is a perfect um things that we have just done now if you want to learn how to model analyze and design a flyover bridge or a bridge design in photo structure i would say that you should just check on the link below and then download the video through the link you will see the complete video of this 
to that link and download the video and then you will know how to design it perfectly and also you have a two years once you buy that link you have a two years subscription free to ask me any kind of question on this put on this software portal structure either in the design of concrete building or design of bridge bridge or a flyover now on that video also you also see the design of this pie foundation for this flyover bridge so this is just to show you um, all the features that is involved in this flyover bridge and what you'll be expecting you also know how to this you can see this also under this bridge also you can see how it looks like you can also see the embankment on this place also so also in that video you also know how to design and you also know how to design an embankment wall just here and also in my coming video we will be designing for a steel bridge and um, we will be starting that also by next two months so also we will also design um different kind of concrete structures but for today this is all we have for you today and i'll say that you should uh, benefit from this so that um, you will be able to also design other kind of concrete um, building. Now, if you have not subscribed to my channel, Ekidel, I will say that you should do that just now. And if you need this video or you want to know how to design a flyover bridge, I will say that you should just click on the link below and download the video. And then you can now enter into my two years free subscription on where you can ask me any kind of question. And also we will learn together on how to design concrete structures. So you can see right now how this looks like. Okay, so thank you and while we wait for the next video.